When is the last time you, my friend, my viewer, my colleague in pursuit of all information about correct wages, when's the last time you accidentally misunderstood the law and stole $900,000 from a group of people? What's that? You haven't done that recently? Hey, I'm Josh Sanford. I'm America's attorney. Now let's get in this video and find out what happened down at the barbecue joint. Do we have barbecue sauce here? I don't know what your news feed looks like, but in my news feed, as a wage attorney, here's what I saw. A barbecue chain called the Hard Eight, which I think is the number of ribs in a rack of ribs, because I ate a half rack today. Spare ribs! And there were four, and I know, Four times. Why are you laughing? Recently agreed to pay $867,000. That's a lot of money. 910 employees who are receiving tips, but not all the tips. And here's what they were doing they were having the tips that come into the restaurant get shared into a pot. Great, that's fine. It is okay to pool your tips. Who can legally share those tips? I know that if you are a regularly tipped employee, which means under the regulations, someone who makes at least $25 per month in tips, if you are a regularly tipped employee, you can share in a tip pool. Provided that, I should probably be dressed as a judge right now. Provided that the tip sharing does not cause your tips to go below minimum wage which in most places is $7.25 an hour, in some places $15 an hour. All right, that's a stupid wig. At Heart 8, they shared the tips with the managers. Now, you can't say that that's a legal tip pool just because the managers always steal our tips. Like, it's not a way to get around the customarily tipped person by saying, well, we always share tips with the managers here. You can't do that! That's not sharing, it's stealing! They got busted for it, and kudos to them, they said, ooh, we didn't want to do it this way. Now, I do laugh a little when I say that they misunderstood the law, because I don't think anyone can misunderstand that stealing tips is not okay. I misunderstood that was your sandwich, and I ate it. Like, no, you didn't, you stole my sandwich! They voluntarily gave the money back, which is awesome. They did the right thing once they got busted, but they got busted for doing the wrong thing. So two wrongs don't make a right, and a wrong and a right don't make a right either. If you work at a restaurant and your tips are being shared with the manager, you might want to share the article, which the link is in the description below. So now you know why Heart 8 had to pay almost $900,000 to 910 employees. But here's the secret tip that you didn't know if you just read the article. Not all 910 employees are current employees of Heart 8. The law allows you to go back in time at least two years, sometimes more, and recover wages that were stolen from you in the past, or as we say, shared by your manager. Don't do that, manager, don't do it. I'm Josh Sanford, I'm America's attorney. Thanks for watching. If you have not smudged the subscribe button with barbecue sauce from Heart 8, right now's your chance to do it. Get on your device, your machine, and get barbecue sauce all over the subscribe button. Get a little bit of sauce on the bell notification button. And if you have the kind of machine that has a share button, get some barbecue sauce on the share button. Now hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I really could go for some barbecue right now. If you know anyone who works at a place where they get tips, share the video with them. Have a great day, bye. Bye, go.